Food? Food. And even more food. That was the theme for Loaves and Fishes Community Services Chef Showdown Competition. Executive Chef Crispin Plata of Maison Sabica, with the help of his sous chefs, Rebecca Boyd Arboski and Dave Kelsch, took on fellow executive chef Mark Grimes of K Fagata and his team of Laura Bokar and Joe Chura. Both sides were fired up for the event. That's what we told them. They should just go home now. Like, we got it. Joe and I got this with Mark, we got it. We've got this hands down, so we're gonna look cash, but we know we've got it. And if we gotta pull out some tricks at the end, nobody's looking. The two teams prepared a three course meal that paid homage to the nonprofit's name. They'll be making an appetizer and they have to use a loaf, because we're loaves and fishes. Then they'll be making an entree with fish, because we're loaves and fishes. And then they'll be making a dessert. Three, two, one, let's cook! The teams quickly got to work, as they had just one hour to prepare and present their dishes to a panel of judges. Eddie Sweeney, a judge and last year's winner, gave us an inside look on how he scored both teams. Obviously the flavor and the taste of the food, the crea creativity, and uh, I, I, actually the cleanliness of the workspace is, for me, important. While the event was a competition, contestants didn't lose track of the importance of the showdown. Somebody's got to win, of course, they'll love to win but it's a friendly competition and, you know, honestly don't want to lose sight of the goal is to raise awareness and funds for a really, really good charity. Grimes and his team were crowned champions, but the real winner was Loves and Fishes, who will help feed over 18,000 people this year thanks to the funds raised by this year's showdown. For Naperville News 17, I'm Christian Cannizal.